we've had a great season of cat cam, but what did we learn? We learned there are lots of things um, to learn about the world. We learned that um, Tony Martin's a great comedian and performer. We learned yeah, Sally's yeah. a good newsreader and going to be a great host in the next few minutes of the show. We learned Yadna's got some beautiful fashions, that Christina is a great niece, and that John Mulligan is very talented, like Madeline too. Um, and uh, we learned the audience wants Tony to host. Yeah! Oh, back up! So, oh, back up! Um, Tony, I'm not Thank you. No, I'm just kidding. I'll just say, I'll just say, don't forget to change the kitty litter. Okay. Thanks, Tony. That's Tony! Tony! Okay, sorry, that. Uh, We've, that's the end of it, is it? We're thank you, Lewis, for oh. that wonderful presentation. Okay, uh, that. Tony, tell get me about cat. your childhood. Woo! Oh. Yeah. 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 Um, Let's get deep! We're not still, this isn't still going out, is I, it? I think it is, yeah. Right. Tell us. Um, we should probably... Just um, uh, be five years old, where were you? Uh, I was in Tikawiti, New Zealand. Yep. Um, the sheep shearing capital. Shouldn't have gone down that path. Um, uh, when, when did you come to Australia, Tony? Uh, in the mid 80s, uh, in the, the new romantic era. What, yeah. what, um, uh, were you, how old were you when you moved? I was, I was 21 initially, and by the time I got here, I was uh, 24. Very formative years for a young man. Yeah. Um, what, what, what um, anything that you miss from New Zealand? Uh, yes, the relentless um, greenery. Beautiful country. Sorry, it's saying that I should promote the next show. It says stay, stay tuned for Stick Cam. They just they film they just film a stick for uh, for half an hour. On, here on the, <laughs> it's Channel Thirty One. No, uh, uh, our main sponsor is Yardner's Fashions. Uh, uh, I should show. mention Yardner's Fashions uh, for all seasons. Uh, to Tony, um, could you please? Um, what do you think? What would you do with a rowdy crowd when you were doing comedy? Um, well, I'm, I'm used to a much more. <laughs> I'm used to a much more sedate crowd than this. I've not Could you drug them? <laughs> could I drug them? No, because you drug them. I, I guess you could drug yeah. them. That would be a, it would be a logistical nightmare, but I would certainly have a crack at that. How do you feel about obnoxious, uh, obnoxious crowd members that break young boys' dreams? Well, I think if, if, if Lewis's dreams have been broken, I think that's unfortunate because he's put a lot of effort into this show and it hasn't always gone to plan. I think last week's episode was very poor. But I mean, you know, I don't want to see the series end with a, a young man's dreams shattered on the ground like a giant. Hey, it, it did have the word shat in it. It wasn't and intentional humour. Have you ever worked in an office, Tony? I have worked in an office, yes. It was harrowing. Do you think there's a correlation between drinking and and, uh, and drinking. office work? Clearly there is. Sorry, it's now saying that I should promote the Eggy Pancake Variety Hour. What's that? Oh, that comes on next week in this time slot. Another wonderful performer who you saw f here first on Cat Cam. <laughs> Thanks to Yadna's Fashion. Thank you. Uh, this isn't really... Hello? Hello. Um, I just wanted to... Um, I just wanted to say a few things. I, did, I forgot to say something at the end of CAD CAM. Can I say it now? Yep, go ahead, Lewis. <laughs> um, I just wanted to thank everybody who was involved in the season. That's you awesome. did really great, and I really appreciated all the, all the camera operators, all the crew, all the studio crew, everybody. You just, you were really good. You made all my dreams come true to be on TV, on live TV again, a show about CAD. Lewis, we've got to go. I'm just getting the, I'm getting the signal. We've got to go. I've got um, one suggestion for the um, cat name. Okay, if quickly. Please name the cat Lewis. Yeah. We'll consider it. We will consider <laughs> yeah. it. Thank you, Thank Lewis. You. <laughs> All right, stay. Stay. No, no. He's hung up. He's hung up. Okay, it's, it seems like a a slightly shambolic ending to what has been a great series. Uh, and on that note, uh, Tony, what makes you happy? 
Uh, what makes me happy is to see John Mulligan performing in this studio. I, I, I thought he was treated disrespectfully. He's a great artist. I remember him playing um, Bloated Corpse 2 in an episode of City Homicide. It was beautiful work. <laughs> and that's all we have time for here at Cat Cam. Tony, thank you very much for coming in today. Mm, thanks for, for having me. Is this how we're, this is, we're ending with this? Oh, we say something about cat litter. Um, he has a catchphrase. What did he? Don't, don't forget the say? cat litter. Don't, don't eat cat litter. Don't no. eat cat litter. What was it, Macca? Who cares? It's Tony Martin. Oh, Tony. It's Tony. Yeah. Yeah. That's very kind, but inappropriate. Sally Walker signing off for Cat Cam.